Uh, here we go. Then we'll be talking about my inspirations for my animations and how I learned to animate. Well, here's the thing about learning to animate. I didn't learn. I don't know how to animate that well. But these, these videos get views, so I'm sure I'm doing something right. Alright, time for the first inspiration. Uh, shoot, I, I don't remember their name right now. Alright, alright, I looked it up. It's like Century. But anyways, I saw their animations when I first got started on YouTube. And I saw how smooth and great their animations were. And basically, I just wanted to make a YouTube video talking about some of the small time animators that deserve more subscribers. Alright, on to the second one. Miss that I make sense. Uh, this is the only uh, YouTuber who actually really acknowledges my existence outside my friends. But she's great. Watch their animations. Uh, they, they even comment on my videos, which is great. So all I gotta say. I feel like I should be saying something more. Well, guys, uh, go subscribe to those channels I mentioned. Uh, I today found out what an end card was used for and why I shouldn't have one at the end of my videos. But who gives a crap? I'm going to put an end card because I want to. Also, it's traditional for animators, but... Uh, go, uh, go subscribe to RKO1738. That's it. Goodbye.